welcome to Date with Danu right here on Hi TV. On the show today, I have some fun people who believe in performing and they are just excellent in what they do. The first guest on the show, well, she is a little pepper pot, but her talent, I'm telling you, it's world class. I'm so happy to have Yohani. Hi, I'm Yohani, a singer, songwriter, and I'm here to go on a date with Danu. So I've watched a couple of shows of Danu and uh, I find it really interesting. So I hope this is going to be as well. So really excited to be a part of this. About Danu, he's got um, a fake laugh. <laughs> Let's see what he's got for us today. Some people never age. Just like Yohani and me. <laughs> I just told her I'm just one year older than her and she was just shocked. I can't believe it that you're in your late 20s. You look so, you look like <laughs> as if just left school. I really thought you must be like 18. I know, I get that a lot. I know. But, you know, I think it's a good thing. That is true. Yeah. But do you like that? Do always people say, aww, chuti kill? Yeah. Do they say it? Yeah. Does it I, irritate you a little bit? Uh, it used to, but... Now I think it's like, it's a good thing. Yeah, true. That yeah, I when you go older, it's a great thing. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so you have become such a sensation when it comes to music. Um, I actually stumbled upon your video some time ago and I heard you sing. You were just off the cuff, so natural. You gave a little introduction in your room, I think, and you just <laughs> said, this is a song I really like, and you just sang it. And it was amazing. How did you discover that you have this in you? As in music? Yeah. Uh, obviously. Yeah, I'm talking about that right now. <laughs> Let's cut that part. <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, from small days, I've been exposed to music and like piano music because my parents put me for classes. Right. I used to go with my sister. And then um, I learned to play guitar through YouTube because it was just. See, you I can use YouTube guitar. for good things. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. So I got it as a gift from my dad. And then, uh, around 2016, mm. I decided to open up a YouTube channel and put some songs, like cover songs out. That's where it all started. Now, performing covers, is it a problem in our country? A little bit. <laughs> it's very confusing because you have everyone performing, singing covers, but is there actually a law here or not? I'm always very confused about it. But I'm going to speak more with uh, a person who has been in this industry for a long, yes. time, more, uh, way longer than you and me put together. <laughs> but he's definitely a very talented man, and he has a uh, he has a string of concerts coming up. And I'm so happy to have him on the show uh, for the second time on Date with Danu. I'm happy to have the one and only Dushant Veeramanna. Hi, I'm Dushant Veeraman. I'm a performing and recording artist. Um, I have been in the industry for about 10-15 years now, yeah. Um, I've done a few movies, uh, done some songs and many performances. So here I am at uh, Owen Pick, a date with Danu. Looking forward to doing this, uh, let's see how it goes. I think deep down, deep down, deep down inside, uh, I don't know, this guy's got a lot of issues. <laughs> so my question was, how hard is it to sing a cover? Tosha, yeah. welcome to the show. Thank you. Thank you for being here. So tell me, uh, I saw a selfie with the two of y'all recently. Yeah. yeah. So, y'all are going to perform very soon as well together. Yes. So, tell me how hard is it to perform a cover in our country? Oh boy. Oh, I think it's pretty easy. But uh, some people have problems. Uh, it's just how you have to deal with it. I think uh, singing as cover is a very simple thing. Yeah. But if you're trying to make money out of it, that's a tough one. So the minute it gets to YouTube and if it's a revenue making song, then it's a problem. 
Yeah, one who owns it can claim for it. So then it's a problem. Right. Because if you are trying to make money off a cover song, you're doing a wrong thing because right. it's not your song. But if it's a matter of singing a song and just uploading it anywhere, for but you can share revenue, right? Does that happen in our country? Yeah, of course. Anything yeah. can be arranged. Okay. It's actually very simple, but if you know how to do it. Okay. Yeah. Because uh, because these claws on performing and artists getting like some money for their music started very recently and not all radio and TV stations follow that, right? But I think they do now. No, not yet. <laughs> not yet. <laughs> not yet. Going to. Uh, going <laughs> yet. So We're hoping to. <laughs> because you know, 10 years ago, I worked in an organization that was very much willing to pay 50 cents, I think, per song or something mm -hmm. of that nature. Uh, where is it right now? So we have a law that says uh, that you're supposed to pay royalty for radio plays, 20 rupees per every play and 100 rupees for every uh, TV play. Right. And there's a breakdown, 6 rupees goes to the lyricists, the composer, then the performers, things like that. And there's a collecting society that has to do okay. the collecting of it. But we have a problem where we have two collecting societies. So the, <laughs> yes, it's supposed to be one. So that's where the problem is. So uh, How, who was the other one who started this collecting process? So, <laughs> yeah, it's it's a long story. But just say there are two organizations. There are many organizations, but right. two have uh, the rights. Okay. Uh, so that makes it an excuse for the people who are supposed to pay to say, okay, we don't know whom to pay. So that's the problem. So now we are fixing that. We are, last week was a awesome week because we these two associations that have the rights to collect, they got together. Wow. And then we. We formed one board, and uh, we hope to yeah, now see good results. Not not just the TV and radio uh, monetization, but internationally, a Deezer, uh, SoundCloud, iTunes. Oh, wow, that's amazing! Everything, YouTube, everything comes under that. That's brilliant. Yeah. So, you, because you are going to be releasing your singles soon, yes. So now you can actually go on the right note. Yes. Not like I these can. ones who have to actually <laughs> be victims of all of this. Yes. Uh, <laughs> But we're going to talk more, but right now we need to complete this set. Uh, we need one more person to join in. I've actually known him when he was a child. That's because I was a child at that time. We used to play cricket down the street. Um, <laughs> age is a very sensitive matter for me these days. <laughs> 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 I'm happy to have the main man behind Infinity, Ashing. Hi, my name is Ashe. Um, I'm a member of the band Infinity. I'm the vocalist and rhythm guitarist. And um, I'm a very, if I, if I say something about, my, about myself, I'm a very open-minded and adventurous individual. I like to try new stuff. So Date with Danu uh, is a show that I've uh, been watching for a long time. Um, pretty excited to be here because he, he, he comes up with a lot of uh, inter interesting stuff. So hopefully things will go good today because uh, he has a tendency to you know, roast people. Uh, maybe I could use some content that I have to you know, roast him back if he roasts me, so let's see how it goes. So Danu. Danu has uh, always been a very interesting character to me. Uh, he has a tendency, as I mentioned earlier, he has a tendency to you know, roast people. Um, so he has been very lenient on me because I'm uh, his friend's son. So hopefully he, he will not close me too much today, let's see. And so we have Ashin. Hello. Hi, thanks for having me on the show. Oh, <laughs> no worries. <laughs> you know, the, the, the reality behind this is from the time I gave him the introduction to when we started this, there has been a huge gap. So. <laughs> that might reflect on our faces. <laughs> Just wanted to let you know so you're aware of it. All right, so I have known this boy when he was very, very small and very chubby. Uh, we were very young at that time. Yeah. Yeah. I was thin at that time, right? Yeah. 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 I, was, I was surprised for you really wrong. Funnily, I actually yeah. know his mum. <laughs> yes. Yeah. So what should, I, what should I call you? Just stick to Danu because you <laughs> and I are same age. I used to call your mum okay. auntie. Okay. Cool. Make sense, no? That yeah, we are from the same era. Same, okay. Just few years apart. Few years. Yeah, yeah. but um, uh, he actually ended up calling poor Dusha's wife <laughs> Auntie Stephanie. <laughs> 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 yeah, yeah. I told him to. Because my mom and <laughs> I encouraged him. 
I encourage him to say that. <laughs> I, I called him uncle too, but he took it like a boss. You know, he's like, thank you. <laughs> I'm like, okay, like, like, you, you, know, you like it, right? I like it. Yeah, you anyway have many views and all, no, so yeah. you fall under the uncle category. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. He's like embraced. Yeah. <laughs> he's like, mm, let's finish this show, Dono. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. All right. No, no. So this infinity, um, did you ever think that you'll be in this music field? Of course, you, you well, have. I, of course, knew that I could sing because my family, you know, they're all into music and stuff. It's but not genetic, you know. <laughs> it's oh, it is. is. I don't it know. Is. I don't it's know if it's genetic, but... My can't sing. <laughs> <laughs> Even my mom can't sing, but, you know. But I, actually, I actually never okay. thought that I would be a musician, you know. Because mm. um, I was always into cricket. Like, 19 years of my life, I dedicated all that to cricket. But then this took, my life took like a huge turn and then I got into music and stuff. You didn't want to get into cricket? I, I, I was hardcore into cricket, but then, you know, injuries and hard, stuff. No, it's just annoying yeah. to get into the team. Yeah, whether <laughs> they got into music. Yeah. Alright, so how is music treating you? It's pretty exciting because um, it's, it's, it's what I like to do, you know, when, you, when you're on stage, you just, you just lose yourself. I just lose myself when I'm on stage. I know you guys would know that too because it's crazy like pe when you give people what, you, what they want and they like it, it's, it's the best feeling ever, you know. Brilliant. So now that we have set the stage for the show, three musicians will speak more about it, of course, when we do come back. Stay tuned this day for that. I've always loved doing this segment and it's called Hot Secret. Because Dushant has been on this show, I'm going to have him as the last person. Okay. Okay? We'll start with... The hottest. The, ho the hottest. <laughs> we'll start with you, honey. Oh, no. Uh, or because you look the youngest. Mm -hmm. Alright? Ready. Here we go. Your favourite out of the duo, Bhatia and Santosh. BNS. Yeah. One person who you have a personal it's a bond towards. Seat. It's a hot seat. Yeah. yeah. <coughs> BNS. <laughs> no, but who? Who? Is one penis? person? No, he said B. I, did, I don't think. Bhatia. Okay, done. <laughs> if you get a chance to collaborate with one of the two, who would it be, and why would you not choose the other, Iraj or Sanuka? Why and who you will not? You're asking really difficult questions. That's the whole point. It's called hot yeah, seat. seat, not to yeah. sit in wait. I need time to think. <laughs> <laughs> um, who I would. Go with. Yeah. And why won't you go with the other? Uh, I would first go with Iraj mm -hmm. and then go with Sanuka. That's fine. So you're going with Iraj is the answer I got. Because why I feel like his style matches my mo. His style matches your mo. Matches like your the beats wise and right. like composition wise. Okay. Out of the two sisters, your personal favorite voice is it Umara or Maria? I'm so glad I didn't get these questions. Are you going to ask these <laughs> questions from them as well? One, two or three. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> so you can do this. Um, Umaria. And Umara. <laughs> First answer is the only thing that we take. If you have to cast someone for your next music video, who would you pick as the villain, the joker and the hero? The na three names you have. Saranga Disa Sekara, Ranjan Ramanayaka, Danu Inasuka. I think you'll be villain. Thanks. I know, right? <laughs> I'm so happy about I that. Think, yeah, I think you, you know. Yeah. I think you got this. And Ranjan, <laughs> <laughs> don't kill me. <laughs> Ranjan as hero? No, as Joker. No, there's a big no there. <laughs> Ranjan as Joker. Yeah. And Saranga as hero. Yeah. Mm. Ashen. Alright. <laughs> Thank you. For your wedding, who would you book? Because you are getting married, no? I would, okay. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Lantra, doctor, yeah. or Viresh from Delhi? Mm, Lantra, doctor. Oh, tell Viresh. Chill, girl, damn. Out of the stars invited to perform along BNS on their concerts, okay. who is your favorite? Randeer, Umaria, Lahiru. Uh, I think Umaria because we like, you know, we have moves together, you know, we share moves <laughs> and we choreograph stuff. So I think it's Umaria because, you know. 
Who is the most stylish artist in the industry, according to you? Kumaria. If you had to write a song for Dushyan and Santush, what would you title it as? Brothers in Arms. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I just said it. It's a hot seat. I'm supposed to answer fast. Brothers in arms? I don't know. I think you're doing a better job. Yeah, than that, I yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's okay. At least you're quicker. This one took like yeah. three hours to answer. Dushyant, All right. this last time for those who want, he, he was in a hotter seat last time, this time. I'm. All right. Would you feature Pumi Hansamali in another music video of yours? I'd like to. Right. Who is the, <laughs> just quickly, <laughs> who is the biggest star out of the voice um, in our country? Out of the judges who were there, Sanuka, Dumal. Sanuka. Oh. You didn't want the other two names as well. Okay, fine. Because um, I know what you're going to say. It's not okay, let me reword this question. Okay, okay. okay. Out of all those who were the faces of Voice for this year, who do you consider biggest star? Sanuka, Dumal, Ashanti, Raini, Stephanie. Sanuka. <laughs> He's very firm with his answers. Brilliant. Thank you. <laughs> it's easy. Uh, why do you think the concept called Dancing Stars have been a failed mission for the last so many years? Dancing Stars? Like all these reality shows with dancing, uh, talents being brought out. Dancing is always a secondary thing in art. You know, it, it's something that you have in the background. To be a dancer and to be known is difficult. So I think, you know, to be a star as a dancer uh, is not an easy journey like being a singer or an actor you know you think of Michael Jackson, Elvis Presley, Bob Marley you know all these names you have Nicolas Cage, Shahrukh Khan and you know Tom Cruise but how many number how many names of dancers do you know mm. so this is a bit of a tougher industry too oh, of course it's yeah. very very tough out of all the songs that Bhati and Santosh have released, a song you personally feel you could have done better with? <laughs> a lot of them. <laughs> <laughs> I, would do, I would definitely do it differently. Okay, and yeah. one song? Oh boy, one song. Mm. Let's say Siri Sangabo. Right. Talking about this particular song, uh, Dushant, you have always been someone who has been a pioneer when it comes to the artist industry uh, in making social media, using it for its fullest potential. You were one of the first who had the highest amount of followers on Facebook. You really milked it. Even when we couldn't be bothered with <laughs> Facebook, you really knew the opportunity that was there. Uh, I'm an opportunist. <laughs> <laughs> now you are really big on YouTube. You have, you have made it. You have make your videos come out. Uh, Stephanie's singular classes are public. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <For so. laughs> yes. So, tell me how how important do you think the you social media platform is, and do you think people are all using it right? Well, it's very important. It's a part of our lives now. Um, that's how we socialize now. Mm. So it's definitely the first question is just how important is very important, and are people are everyone using it correctly? No, obviously not. Mm. No, there's this this is a, a whole science to it. A lot of uh, it's like being it's it's the new new social life. So if you are a good uh, social person, you'll probably know how to use it well, and if you are not a, a social person, you probably not use it very correctly. Yeah. All right. So that lot to learn. Let's take a break. When we do come back, we have so much more to talk about. We have to put them into like different situations in life. All this and more when we do come back. Date with Danu right here on High Tea. There's always something great when we do this show. We kind of make use of the people who are on this show to get the word out about this show. It's time to update your status. Updating the 
investigators. I shall speak to Yohani. So, hmm. this singing covers to releasing your own songs. When did you decide to take this? It was in 2000, la uh, last year, 2009. It was in <laughs> before Christ. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, last year. It was last year because I finished my studies, uh, my masters, and then I thought probably I should change to a music career. Mm. But did you do your masters in? In accounting. Yeah, that's perfectly fine. Perfectly fine. Yeah. And my parents were like, "What are you doing?" <laughs> mm. But then I came back last year, and then I started to do a couple of pub gigs just to get a hang of it because it was my first time performing. Yeah. Uh, that's how it started, actually. Okay. Did you ever think that you'll have a reach? Because there are so many people singing online no, today. I didn't. What do you think that is in you that sort of made people like you? Mm, I'm not too sure why. We lost Kashi in this. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe. You all have known each other for a long time. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Not not mm, a long. Like, like since this year. This year. Ah, okay, okay, okay. Okay. Yeah. And what has, what has been? What do you think it's in her? The vibe that she gives out. To people and how she performs <laughs> and stuff, you know. I think yeah. that's what people like. So, she's being herself, so that's yeah. yeah. So now this Infinity Band, yeah. y'all have been performing covers and singing. Yeah. When did you start? When you were in school? Um, as soon as I left school, actually, in 2016, okay. end of 2016, maybe. Um, so it has elevated from there. So hopefully, you can do something bigger soon. So. Y'all are getting into your originals? Yes, we, we've been working on our originals like since Corona happened, so we didn't have any gigs. So <laughs> perfect time. No perfect time did. actually. <laughs> we, we, we built a studio too, so it's pretty convenient for us to just hang around there and come up with new content. Yeah, it's a know. cool studio. Yep. Super. Nice. So are you going to be doing collaborations or is it just going to be straight off y'all? We we're, we're planning on doing an album Okay. with few collaborations as well, so just hope for the best. Okay. Now, those you have <laughs> You have kept. You have been in the industry for a long time, and you yes. have seen. You have not even heard them. Then you have seen them. You have seen them grow and become to where they are right now. Uh, what What has changed in the last few years? Because everyone puts out a song, no? Now, I think talent has improved. Mm. That's a change. Uh, they also have a lot of opportunity on more than platforms. Yeah, I don't know whether they have more opportunities. I feel that they have a huge loss in the the radio and the uh, TV segment, mm. which was so much more easy to reach everyone True. in millions. Yeah, in one go. In one go, yeah. but the right I show plays your song at the right time. You are yeah. Done. I think it's much tougher now to be known mm. to reach out to people. It's much harder now, even though there are easy ways of getting by, you yeah. know, having your own YouTube channel or your Facebook or your Instagram, but it's still so hard because it's you it's so hard to, you know, improve your own subscribers. That you know, you have true. to work on that. You have to do the the media work by yourself. Self. So I think it's tougher for them. But these guys are I feel they have a lot more talented than before. Yeah. All right. Let's get into a little game where we give prizes out. And this part is called One Word, where we sort of ask you questions. There's no right or wrong answers. The one who is quicker wins it. Talk can overlap or whatever, but the one who gets in the highest amount of answers wins, okay? Ready? Yep. Do you believe in something after death? Yes. yes. Coffee or tea? Tea. tea. Oh. <laughs> Do you believe in ghosts? No. Yes. Twitter, Facebook or Instagram? Instagram. Instagram. Odd numbers or even numbers? Odd. Odd. Love or money? Love. money. Love. TV shows money. or movies? <laughs> movies. <laughs> Books or magazines? Books. Books. Which is more Coffee. preferred? Being nice or being fair? fair? Fair. Which do you prefer? Logic or creativity? Creativity. What's the special thing that you have eaten? Sushi. What's the most expensive thing you have broken? A TV, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> you broke a TV? Yeah, I was playing inside and <laughs> boom. No wonder you're not in the cricketing career. <laughs> <laughs> but I must say, I choose you as the winner. Oh. Yeah. 
Thanks, man. You all are really like Napuru in the way you all clap. I can't give this to you. No, no, no. You sit, 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 sit. I'm being polite. Ane sin, ane. He got up as well. Well brought up. Ah, well brought up. I'm going to leave this uh, with me. Yeah. You can pick it up later. <laughs> That's how we do this. We actually recycle them. No, no, we don't. <laughs> we give it to you for real. Uh, let's get into a break. We'll see you on this other side. <laughs> Welcome back to the show. So we are going to be playing Do You Hear What I Say? It's all about lip reading. So are you re guys ready? You want to start because of the, you have the headphone already. No? Put it on. No, no, no. Put it on, will you? Do you hear what I say? No, I guess not. No? What am I saying? Huh? Nothing, nothing. Put it. <laughs> Ready? Kissing you under the dark blue sky. Huh? Kissing you under the dark blue sky. Can we break it down? Kissing you under the dark blue sky. Is tell you what? Huh? Kissing you under the dark blue sky. Music, I. Yeah. Kissing you under the dark blue sky. <laughs> she does this a lot. <laughs> Kissing you under the dark blue sky. What? What name? Guess. Kissing you under the dark blue sky. Hmm? Where's my whistle? Where's my whistle? Poof! It's done. <laughs> I can't. Have I, <laughs> I've lost my whistle. All right. You are done. You have lost. You have lost. I have given you too much of your time. Oh, no. Ashan to you. Ashane. Ashane. Oh. Why can't you just spell your name in an easy way, man? I'm sorry. A S H E N E, right? Yeah. yeah. So hard to find. Ashane. Ashane. You can hear what I'm saying? You're just saying no. What does that mean? <laughs> that means you can't hear. Do I start now? No, nothing. Ah, okay. You end up calling Stephanie Auntie. You're what? You end up calling Stephanie auntie. You're a boy that's <laughs> lucky. <laughs> <laughs> With who? <laughs> They're kids, no? <laughs> uh, you end up calling Stephanie auntie. Really? You end up calling Stephanie auntie. You're, you're a boy that's wearing... Where is this boy coming from? You end up calling Stephanie auntie. <laughs> Thank you. Okay. Thanks for blowing. <laughs> blown. Lost. You end up calling Stephanie auntie is oh. what I said. Are uh, kissing you under the dark blue sky. <laughs> You're all just really Because bad. you have blue hair. Yeah. <laughs> That's the inspiration. Okay. I'm giving you a very easy one, okay? Okay. All right. Ah, here I can see your ears nicely peeled off outside. <laughs> what? Ah, nothing. What? <laughs> yeah. And Has this game started? Yeah. Ah, okay. <laughs> Can you hear me what I'm saying? <laughs> right, are you ready now? <laughs> ice cream, you scream, we all scream ice cream. What? That's way too long. Oh, ice cream, you scream, we all scream ice cream. Something about a swim. <laughs> <laughs> ice cream, you scream, we all scream ice cream. Ice cream, you scream, we all scream ice cream. Ice cream, you scream. You're giving you scream. <laughs> <laughs> you're giving <him> <laughs> Uh, ice cream, you scream. Uh, say it again. Uh, ice cream, you scream, we all scream ice cream. Ice cream, you scream ice cream. <laughs> you know, somewhat there. Oh, yeah. I actually oh, narrated it a little bit too much no, for you. I should have had the deadpan look. Did I win? Yeah, you win. Did you win last time? No, no. I think you lost. I can't remember. Yeah, I think you lost. Anyway, this is for Stephanie. I don't think you are going to do it anyway. You can share. 
from the day I got married. <laughs> I've never won anything to myself. Nothing in your life has <laughs> been, <laughs> even food has nothing been shared. For me, <laughs> nothing for me, everything goes. <laughs> Alright, let's get into a break. There's a huge problem when it comes to the food issues that the Veeramans face at home. Um, this boy has been actually either eating too much or not eating at all. We'll speak more when we do come back. Please stay tuned. So, Dushyant, you have been planning a few concerts that are coming up in October, yeah. uh, September. Mm -hmm. Tell me about it. And you're working with a very a refreshing lineup of artists, including Stephanie, for yes. the first time on like a after long time, yeah, first and also <laughs> long time. <laughs> <laughs> and she's singing Sangapo Dima Lika Yes, yeah. so that was all the that challenges training. we got on YouTube. Okay, so she nailed it. She mm. did really well. And she's singing faster than the original, I yeah, 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 a lot faster at 150 BPM. My God, now she can do it a lot faster than that. I think she's just saying it whenever she's around. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So, so tell yes, me about this concert. On, on, the, on the 12th of September, we have a show at um, Vihara Mahadevi. So, mm. is, uh, Johan is in it as well. Okay. And then we have another one um, together. Also. Yeah, in Kandy. On the 18th of October. In, in Kandy. Kandy. Yeah, in Kandy. All right, that's yeah. excellent. Uh, this, is, this is something that you always do every year. I've been a part. Oh, no, no, no. This is, yeah, this is not just once a year. It happens uh, yeah. a bit more often than that. But there's this one particular song of yours which I have been asking you to mu do a music video. Which one is that? The one that I really like. Gomaramala? Yes. Mm, yeah. One of my favourite songs. Only if you be Gomaramala. For sure! I said it. <laughs> yeah. That will be a music video. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Did you want me to be in Red the Hat? For sure. I just wish you can see my hips. I can really move them. Okay, hired. Thank you. I need to wax this part. <laughs> oh, please. <laughs> please do! Please do! <laughs> you know, this um, South Indian films have a thing towards this the belly button. Okay. Yeah. Do you, so so I might. Where are you can go with this? No, I can really like go to town if I was in. You should get a belly button, please. You think my expectations were anything lower than <laughs> oh, that? I want you. you to go to town. If you are going to Ramala, you better be a proper yeah. Ramala. <laughs> I didn't want you to go any lower than my belly button as well. <laughs> <laughs> That's the first time he laughed out loud. <laughs> okay, this boy is too young to be in this conversation. Yeah, yeah, yeah true. <laughs> okay, but now yes. tell me about you. You have planned tours and all until Corona came and yeah. like stopped everything. Yeah, we yeah. were supposed to tour together. My actually. God, can I carry bags? <laughs> <laughs> we were supposed to do a Europe to Italy. Europe. Yeah, yeah, Italy for sure. Ah, Italy. Italy is, uh, yeah. 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 And um, we were actually in Australia in March. We played in Brisbane. We came back uh, before playing Sydney and Melbourne because of Corona. yeah. Otherwise, you would have been just stuck away for like four. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah. So how was it? How did you ever like this tour experiences? How yeah. is it? It's it's. Uh, we went on our first tour in 2018 to mm. Dubai. It was like pretty exciting. That was the first time we went. Yeah. Like, all the all the boys were like. Oh. Do you all have like uniforms and all? No. Uh, no, we didn't. Yeah. We didn't. But the last the last tour we had like. A, a jacket like thing. <laughs> but you are managed. Yes. <laughs> that sounds really odd. Yes. You are managed by an agency or like? Yes, uh, called Pet Effect. Okay, and that's where we used to first see you a lot. Yeah, so yeah. that's where I started as well when I first joined. It was with. Are they flexible? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. Because I first started with Thibra, that was an advertising agency, and then Pet Effect came, so everything kind of integrated. Together? Yeah. Yeah. Hmm, interesting. You all keep your answers very short. <laughs> Let's get into what's on their Facebook. This Johani's Facebook account, I know what. You don't have a personal account? No, I don't even have my password to my Facebook. Why? Because I post stupid stuff sometimes, so... People have taken it, yes. taken you off it. <laughs> Good choice. All right, let's. Uh, so we did some digging to see what's on their Facebook. Oh Why no. <laughs> oh. What? Wait a minute. What's on their Facebook? We did some digging and telling the honest truth, uh, couldn't find much. Man. So I'm also threatened on this show, uh, but I'll come to that a bit later. Uh, Dushyan, although I love your long hair, this is my favorite look of yours. This is the only reason I brought it. Oh. 
Is it such a nice look? Yeah. yeah. Such a papa, na? <laughs> no, but I really like this look. I think you should really go back to this. Okay. Super. My mom says the same thing. There you go. <laughs> we always know what we're saying. <laughs> so you'll cut it, right? Yeah, maybe not now. Maybe <laughs> later. Mr. Ogier, it was nice. All right, so this is the time I sort of knew Ashayan. Ooh. <gasps> yeah. Oh my God. So it's not yes. same face. You have just grown a beard. Yeah. That's about it. It's the monkey clinging on to the mother. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and that's Koshi. She used to be a model. Yeah. Uh, she's she was fabulous on the ramp. Um, oh. Aww. Do you have a girlfriend? Uh, mm. <laughs> <laughs> ah. He's like, uh, yeah, uh, 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 <laughs> and it, it translates uh, to not yet. <laughs> not yet. Not yet. Yeah, 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 these will give you opportunity. See? I, probably, I probably will. But yeah, that's after the show. Say, yeah, you should yeah, take yeah, a yeah. After yeah. the show, definitely yeah. with these photos, you'll get there fast. Yeah. Uh, how tall are you? Short. <laughs> <laughs> But just <laughs> in terms of height? 5'2". Uh, um, is this dog taller than you? <laughs> no, it's not. <laughs> it's just I'm like... Where was this? You're an adventurous child, aren't you? Yeah, a little bit. <laughs> you, you, she drives vehicles that are bigger than her and me. Yeah. <laughs> and break them. <laughs> yeah. This is what I was talking she, about. Yes. So I used to do off-road driving and stuff. Like on oh. Really? Yeah. Were you off the vehicle and the road? I'm sure. <laughs> I mean, yeah, like legit. I used really? To, yeah. Isn't there a required amount of body weight? No, I no, think. I guess it helps if yeah, you are less. Oh, ah, like really? It. Okay, okay. Dushyant, I have a question to ask you. Mm -hmm. How short is a short when you wear it? How short is a short? <laughs> oh, how short is this short? <laughs> oh, how short come on. Is this short. Oh, oh. okay. <laughs> Oh, that's that's like a kid's shot. Yeah, kids but you can see the hole there everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> it's a peaky peaky shot. <laughs> I can see. Yeah, <laughs> Pedro. <laughs> no, but it's so short, and it's on social media. You should have put a little face. Yeah, there. but do you remember the time there were shorts? Sh like shorts, shorts were considered shorts, shorts yeah. until long shorts became shorts. shorts. But so this is a normal shorts? pair of but shorts. But now these shorts are back. Ah, there you go. Yeah. You should wear it. I try. <laughs> <laughs> now say something. Oh. <laughs> That's the same face. <laughs> That's the same face. Oh. Do it again. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, that, that, that's me in my natural state, so... What yeah. is this for? What were you making this face for? It was not, It was actually... What? I don't know, that was not me. I didn't post it. So, do you feel that the youth of our country will be looked after? Yeah. Probably. <laughs> I mean, you should... Hopefully. I'm Hopefully. asking because yes. you will I collaborate with the song. Yeah, sword. yeah. Uh, I, I kind of, you kind of have to survive on your own at one point. So no no council or no committee is going to help? Uh, it, it is it, going uh, to help. Okay. But you're but just saying... end of the day, I mean... You have to hustle your way through. Yeah. <laughs> okay. This is the good old days of... Oh. <laughs> I took this picture just to see the difference. There is a significant change, no? Yes. Uh, yeah, I've aged. <laughs> <laughs> but how old do you think I am over there? Uh, 25? Mm, good guess. Thanks. How did you get to yourself out of these vaccine pants? It's like you're wearing this couch. Are those, on those are leather <laughs> pants. Absolute, I think. Yeah. I think it's like you're wearing this couch. Yeah, I got from Thailand on, on my way to uh, China for a musical <laughs> show. I didn't have a I didn't have a costume. I was going for the uh, Chinese mis music festival uh -huh. with Umara, uh -huh. and uh, I realized everybody had like you know amazing costume, and I didn't have one. So I I was had a stop in Thailand. So I had a like a twenty four hour shop there. I did these leather costumes. I went there, got it done, and that's how I performed. And then Just imagine yeah. if you wear it here, Thailand nadi. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> surprisingly, no. Yeah. Surprisingly, it no. Doesn't, it doesn't no. No, it does. no. I don't wear the pants anymore because. Yeah, but doesn't that, it that tambinify down there? No, I mean, we are always <laughs> in an air conditioned uh, environment, yeah, like, okay, you know. You know, that place generates a lot of heat. Oh. 
The monkey is sick. That's my brother actually. What? <laughs> no, no. No, I I just wanted to know whether. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Sorry. Now, what is this picture that your mother sent? Which okay. I I'm so not aware. Of. I I'm sure it's either you, heat. You've gotten embarrassing pictures of us, so you got a picture of you when you look like a sex bomb. So. Oh. <laughs> That's you and my mom. Yeah, I know your mom. She looks the same still. I don't know what happened yeah. to her. I nah. I don't have the t-shirt. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's how I tried to how see. How old him. were you there? Very young. I was around his age. Yeah. Younger ah. than that. Would have been 19. <laughs> yeah, this was after a show or before Did the show. Did you keep this, you know? No. <laughs> It will just make me sad. <laughs> I've just got wiser with time and bigger with age. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Before we wrap things up on the show, uh, thank you guys. I know we had a bit of a technical hitch today, but you guys were so kind to like uh, stick mm-hmm. around and like not leave me hanging here. Uh, thank you so very much for that, um, Dushan. I'm so happy that you're doing these shows, and I can't wait to be your Matwa Mala, Gomara Mala, Gomara Mala. Gomara Mala, Vata Sarasala, Hada Vada Kamunat, Enganala. It's my favorite song. Yeah, there you go. Sing it, we do like <laughs> sing it. Prop record it, release it again. Okay, okay, we'll Thank do you. it. I, this is like my fourth year request. Are you going to like shave for that? You really want me in this, no? But a big mala. Oh yeah, okay. I'm excited now. What about him? Do a do a sing the game. When you do play. one round, the song is done. <laughs> You said if I'm going to get Bhumi Hansuma this is going to be you and me these are natural baby yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah they are natural <laughs> just not you know <laughs> Ashen uh, thank you so much for being here such young talent it's great to see uh, he comes to the gym and I know a few people who have kept their eyes on him um uh, yeah you are in demand boy uh, but it com- it's coming from both places <laughs> oh, all right <laughs> Uh <laughs> Yohani um uh, excellent talent and I can't s- so wait much. to hear your originals coming out. Thanks. Uh all the very best and be this quirky you. I think that's <laughs> what's keeping you going and your blue hair it really goes very well. Thank you so all much. All right. Super. On that note we're going to wrap things up on the show. It has been absolutely amazing having them. We'll see you with another cool edition to date with Dan. Until then you keep smiling. It's a wrap.